YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to Infliction Extended Cut, apparently. This is a game that was suggested by many of you guys for me to check out. Uh, I have no idea what it's about. Like usual, I like to approach my games like that. Makes for a very immersive, scary, and exciting experience. And I hope you join me on this journey. It's a pretty... Um, it's like a three-hour or two, three-hour-ish game. So uh, it's a little bit longer than the shorter videos, but strap in. Join us for this awesome journey. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. And let's hop into Infliction. This is the place between places. Here there can be only sadness and resolution. This is where the lost are found and vengeance rears its ugly head. Vengeful souls are born of violence and death. Violent death. Necronomicon. Abaddon Volume 3. Necronomicon. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, baby. This station has received reports that the two lighthouse keepers from Oxford Point Island Lighthouse have vanished. The lighthouse keepers work. You have one unheard message. One hundred message. Unheard message. Hi, baby. I'm stuck at the gate and they won't let me through. When you get back home, can you look for my ticket? I must have left behind. Have a good look around and let me know. Love you. See you soon. Okay. End of message. To delete this message. <laughs> <laughs> to delete. Oh. Car crash. This is a 30 FPS car crash right here. Unfortunate. Be careful. Look at the road. You know that a lot of traffic jams are, cr are created by people looking at accidents and then slowing down and then traffic jams are created even though they shouldn't happen. New objective, find the plane tickets. Take with you. F. Use flashlight. New tutorial unlock, check under gameplay in the menu to view tutorials. Bro, who do you think I am? I know every game. Oh. Oh, oh, close it. Well, I guess I'm going here. This one open? Thank you. Okay. Well, I gotta say, I mean, don't want to be rude or anything, but for a, an Unreal Engine game, I was expecting the graphics to be slightly better, but that's all right. <laughs> I don't mind. I don't mind graphics like this. Absolutely not. But all right. Well, that is one way to get in your own house. Let's find those plane tickets, shall we? What is with this eyeball? Big box? What is it? Wow, nice rafting skills. Oh my god, a puppy. <laughs> I can't Put a puppy in a this. box? I love her. I'm gonna call you Sally. Sally the dog. <laughs> okay, okay. Now it's time for your gift. Puppers. Look how clever our little girl is. I'm I'm not sure exactly what's going on here, but she can already draw better than I can. She takes after her daddy. The meat is thawing under on, on the sink. I'll call you later. Or it's it's trash night. Crunchy wheat. Tom, thank you for the prime. Okay. Public access. <laughs> what the fuck is this? A welcome about to cooking with Massimo. <laughs> have you ever come home from a work and found yourself stuck what to what the have the fuck for is this, bro? <laughs> Today, I've been asked to cook with ingredients you found around the house. What does no he have a okay? very exaggerated Italian accent? <laughs> Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. It's funny, man. The Exorcist 1 and 2. Oh. Oh, memory. 
Do you, Sarah Angel Adage, take Gary Ryan Powell to be your lawfully wedded husband? To have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do you part. I do. Okay. <laughs> and the guy that's implied. Go upstairs. I don't really know. I'm just like kind of looking at everything right now. This is one big house, baby. Whoa, Scappy! Scappy, thank you for the five gifts. Oh, thank you so much. That's a huge crib. Huge crib anomaly. It grew for sure. Cuddles, snug fit. Why can I? <laughs> okay. The fact that you can interact with everything is kind of weird. Next room. Oh, so close. That's stinky toilet. Stinky. Okay, well then. Um, I guess we're going over here. hunting nice we got a balcony it's locked someone stop pleasant fall security doors zero five one six got it noted thank you zero five one six that will be on the test guys remember what is this phasmo all right let's go Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Doesn't work. Dead for sure. <laughs> this is one ugly floor, by the way. Uh, z zero five one six. Yes. Alrighty. Dr. Cow. Sugar free gum. It's 4 a.m. That is one old computer. Flight tickets. Boarding time 3 5. Oh, you got two minutes? Uh oh. Uh oh. What in the heck? Kind of cool. I like that. Okay, we gotta call her right away. Um. Hang on, what, what are you doing? What's with the mask? Post event? Uh, is it actually me or is he? Oh, it's me. Oh, wait. So we were in the car accident. Dude, my mind is broken. Dude. <laughs> that's kind of cool. I like that. <laughs> wait, that's kind of epic. 
But I like the gate. Just the two of us in here. See you soon. Holy shit. Okay, this is cool. I like this. That's a good start, man. It was a little bit weird, but then. That's nice. A little bit of a slow start, but very spooky. Oh. Find a way to vanquish the spirit? Are we playing ghost underscore now? What the frick? How does one do that? Do we throw holy water at the spirit? Recite the exorcism book? Oh, that's a weird one. Okay, I can probably hide there. What in the fuck am I doing? Okay. Um. <laughs> Sorry. Are these? Okay, everything is now... There's blood. Yeah, can we find the shalt shotgun, please? You who hunt this place. <laughs> What? Okay, I'm confused, but... Uh... Why did the world lose its textures? Oh, that's the sound. Am I supposed to know what's going on? Murder, suicide? I am fairly confused. Um, that's a knife. Chef. Can I hold it? Can I have this? What if I zoom in like this? <laughs> that's, that gives me bad feelings. Listen up. We've got some news hot off the presses. Sorry. It's a bike. Of course. Hey there. My thoughts are dark, black as night. Life is sparse, a total abs absence of light. When it's all over, come find me, dear. A broken soul. I belong nowhere. I feel better today. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> June 6th, 1999. My hands are shaking as I write this. Maggie's gone. Michael's gone. And Gary's gone too. At least the man I love is. It's just me and the monster living inside Gary. And the beatings are getting worse and I'm running out of excuses. So tired. The lady next door came over yesterday. She must have heard something. She urged me to call the police, but I just can't do it. I love Gary so much. He's never gotten over my believing us. And he blames me. And maybe it is my fault. All he does is drink, locked in that basement day and night reading those weird books. He's so unhinged now. What do I do? I can't abandon him. I know Gary's in there somewhere and I'll be right here when he surfaces again. Fuck, this is so hard. I have to stay strong for him. Mm. That's it. And then someone in chat says, wait, the day is 69.9. <laughs> What am I doing? Uh oh. Help. Uh, 
on the window? Huh? Holy sh moly. The fuck was that? I lose in the... M I look in the mirror. I see only a husk. Nine one one, what is your emergency? I can hear him. Are you in need of medical assistance? He stabs me. I need you to stay still. I'm dispatching a patrol car and ambulance to your location. He's still in the house. I can hear him. Help will be there in thirty seconds. Please. Thirty stay seconds. This is one quick. Are you still there? That's fucking creepy. I hate that. <laughs> oh no, it's crash scratched over. Never mind. I thought that was supposed to be like that. Oh my, hello. <laughs> Let's look into the mirror. that say mirror mirror achievement unlocked i can't read insanity sorry i can't read i'm a dummy well, these are some cool looking paintings honestly very dark but cool is there a satanic ritual going on over oh yeah as, as you do. That's kind of cool. I like that. It looks cool. Spells contained within this book are your pathway to the power beyond your human ability to imagine. <clears throat> for one, for once, you to learn the intricacies of wielding such power, the book and the rights within will no longer be needed. Your body and soul will become a conduit for the darkness. Dark power and energy will be transferred to you into an object on, or focused on a task. You will give direction to those energies, their agents on this plane of existence. That does not mean this book should be taken lightly. Its contents are dangerous and should be treated with respect. Okay, I'm not gonna read all of this, I'm sorry, but I'll, I'll, I'll go past it if you wanna read it yourself. Find a way to vanquish the spirits. Angry spirits are boi born in violent death. To set the spirit free, you will need to perform a ritual. For this ritual, you will need to gather the following objects belonging to the angry spirit. Body of the deceased, any part of the remains. Image of the deceased, clothing worn in the eyes of God. An object of ancestral significance. Once collected, cleanse the objects with fire and spread the ash over the site where they were slain. Interesting. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. What the fuck? Hello? Hi there. Excuse me. <laughs> Wait, did I just fucking die? Wait. Huh? I'm confused. A 
woman was found murdered in her home. Stabbed over ten times. Managed to make a call to 911. Had been victim to domestic abuse. Just me living in my house. He's drunk. Maybe it is my fault. Abandoning him. This is very interesting. But this is new. That is not. This is new. Unless I am all the way back at the very beginning. But I doubt that. <laughs> Wait. Oh no. That wasn't that was that was scripted. Because look, find some of her remains. New objective. Why the fuck did you disappear? <laughs> Find some of her remains. Okay, let's go. Find it. I don't think it's in the baby room. Didn't she get stabbed? Where did she get stabbed? I forgot. Hello. Just picked up a cam. To switch to cam mode, press C. Once in cam mode, you can take photos. Photos will often reveal hidden clues and surprises you wouldn't be able to normally see. If you're stuck, try taking a photo. You might find a solution or a clue. Oh, did it say something else? Wait, what did it say there? <coughs> okay then, well, whatever. This is litter. What? Oh, hello. Push the thing. Oh, there's a key. Take with me. Very nice. <clears throat> uh, that's on this door, probably, isn't it? Yes. Well then. A spokesperson from the CADV, or Citizens Against Domestic Violence, had mentioned during a press statement that it's easy to turn a blind eye to domestic violence by explaining away the problem. Often in cases like these, the victim is in love with their assailant. As we all know, love often drives the action. These cases often need outside intervention, but ultimately, it is up to them to help themselves. Usually, the assailant in these situations will suffer from addiction and sometimes deeper psychological problems. If you or someone you know is involved in a situation like this, please contact our anonymous helpline for guidance. In other news, the annual Orange Plum Festival is in contrast there. Dishes are fine town has to offer. It's a very dark game. Dealing with some heavy issues. Uh, the door's literally open, friend. You're not fooling anyone. That is epic looking. Sorry, but screenshot time. Are we in a? Are we in the phasmophobia asylum? Man, what the fuck's going on here? Was that a? What the fuck? <laughs>
What? Unlucky for s Riddle me this. Unlucky for some. No, not the answer of the riddle on there. It's a I'm lot not of pills. The one with problems. I just need to numb the pain. It's the only thing I can do to not feel. <clears throat> okay. Dang. A spokesperson from the CADV or Citizens Against Domestic Very dark Violence indeed. mentioned during a press statement that it's easy to turn a blind eye to domestic violence by explaining away the problem. Often in cases like these, the victim is in love with their assailant. As we all know, love... Who the fuck are you? All you do is drink. Outside intervention, but You're a monster. You don't live like this anymore. Usually, the assailant in these situations will suffer from addiction and sometimes deeper psychological problems. Yvonne, thank you for the prime. We're back here. Did I die? I don't think I did. Shit is weird. I like it. Like, it's super creepy. <laughs> I, I already took that picture. Oh, come on, broski. Okay, don't open doors. I get it. Just walk. <laughs> Bro, I just wanted to see, man. I just wanted to see what was going on in there. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Don't open the doors. Just walk. Noted. <laughs> we wanted to see the meat room. The room room. What the fuck? It is slightly changing every time, which is pretty cool. I like that. <clears throat> nope, just normal. Artemin, thank you for the nine months. <laughs> thank you for being here. What a lovely photo. Let's go. Not opening any doors this time. You don't get me. What? Wait, this is endless? Oh, cut. oh Katie, thank you for the five gift subs. Thank you so much. Thank you. Nothing? Really? Well, there's a fingerprint on this. Hmm. <clears throat> Wait, so I need to open... Probably the right door? I'm guessing that if I just open like a random door, I get freaking killed. Have we, f have we had any knowledge? Oh, what is this? E take with you. Wait, you have limited photos? Condolences. Wait, can I open this? To Sarah, Gary, plus Maggie, our deepest sympathies. If you need anything, please know we are here for you. Love the Smiths. Um, I'm confused. Nigma, thank you for the, uh, Five bucks. We don't really have those locations around the Netherlands as far as I know. Not near me anyway. <clears throat> Do I just open this and then just die? Or not, I guess? What the fuck is going on here? What is f coming here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Well, that's really cool. That's beautiful. That painting is sick. That's a teeth! Take with me! Is it part of her body? Find some of her remains. Objective completed. Oh. What the fuck is going on? Jesus. <clears throat> That's creepy. David, thank you for the four months. He wants his teeth back. It's easy to turn a blind eye to domestic violence. All you do is drink. I need you, and I love you more than I can express. I don't understand how you pass. Sometimes he scares me. I just feel the number of pain. Sometimes he has a lot of I like games that, like, I like games that blur the lines between like a death state and a not and a continuation state. It makes me confused and it makes me it's very effective at keeping me on my on the edge. I mean, sometimes it can be overused too, but it's something I haven't really seen too much. It happens in some games. It's like a PT-ish way to do it. If it's done well, it works well. Baby! Baby! To hide, can I take a photo? <laughs> Nothing? Okay, I can hide here, I guess. I don't know how I like that. What the fuck is happening? There was a journal, was there? Let me check it. Did I not see it? Oh, in the oh. You've taken so much. I have no faith left. I hate you. June six, nineteen eighty six. I can't believe he's gone. Only six months. Aww. His little body was so cold. He never even had a chance. And I miss him so much. And Gary hasn't spoken to me since it happened. I think he blames me. And maybe he's right. I was here with Michael. And now he's gone. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe this. How can you take it from me? <laughs> the police questioned me for seven hours yesterday. And how is a grieving mother supposed to survive an interrogation? Maggie's only six and doesn't understand what's going on. And I need to stay strong for her. Gary's been drinking, so I'm on my own. Oh please. Make this stop. <laughs> That's truly sad. This game is fucking dark as hell, man. The voice acting is really good, yeah. Wow. <laughs> also cool. He's gone, but I still hear him. He's trying to talk to me, but it's faded.
Oh, we need a picture from the, for the, yeah, for the ritual. Cut the rest of the photo. Oh. Uh-oh. Police thing. Yeah, exactly, Anastasia. Thank you for answering I the question. I told you I was sleeping. He was out with Maggie getting ice cream or something. I, I don't know. I was asleep. Look, my baby boy just died. And I don't know how. What kind of God would kill an innocent baby? I didn't kill my son. Yes, I had postnatal depression, but I'm telling you. I woke up and I had a strange feeling that they were wrong. Jesus and Christ. I ran through the room and I found his crib collapsed. His lifeless body. And he flew on the bus. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this, this lady's voice acting carries the entire thing. It's crazy. This is like, I perfect. Sounds way too real. <laughs> Sounds depressingly real. investigation has begun into the tragic death of a six-month-old baby boy. The father was out with their six-year-old daughter buying groceries. When they returned home, they found the mother of the child holding the infant in her arms. Authorities have taken the mother in for questioning, but she has since been released. A spokesperson for Pleasant Falls PD told us that the death has been ruled accidental. However, the investigation is ongoing. It's believed that faulty nursery equipment may have failed causing this tragedy. InfoCare has issued a full recall on all their bassinets in accordance with the ongoing investigation. Our best wishes and condolences go out to the family involved in this tragedy. Got a pass. Pleasant Falls. Oh, I miss, I miss going on vacation, going places. Corey Smith. Gonna go up or down? Oh, here. Beep. Uh, whoa, what is happening here? Third floor butchery achievement. Pleasant Fa F Falls Police Department case file. How Michael was found deceased by mother. How Sarah in their home. The mother claimed she was sleeping and awoke to a disturbance in her son's bathroom, bedroom. Upon investigation, she had discovered her son's lifeless body. This investigation has begun to determine the cause of death and where to place, and where to place responsibility. The husband, Pout Gary, and daughter, Pout Maggie, were not in the residence at the time of death. They have not been ruled out, but are cur not currently of interest to this investigation. At the time of opening this case file, Pout Sarah is the primary suspect. Should foul play be determined? <clears throat> what the fuck? Oh, another piece of the photo. Uh oh. <laughs> I think that was not scripted. <laughs> oh my goodness.
Wait, maybe? What? <laughs> Um, find a photo of this. Wait, don't tell me we have to go all the way back to that police department. No, no, no. I don't doubt it. At least I hope I doubt it. Let's see. What am I doing? It's very quiet now all of a sudden. Have we not? We started here. Wait, what is happening? Huh? What am I doing? Are we in a... I... I can't hear you. Find me on the baby monitor. Huh? Okay, wait. Wait, do we have to do that again? Oh, yo, yo, what the biggity, what? My, my brain's hurting. Like, what is happening? Heh. <sighs> oh, here, the picture. Okay. Objective complete? Oh wait, so we did- Oh my goodness. The, this game is really keeping me on my- Like that right there, I was totally certain that I just died and I and I had to replay a section, but I actually kept my photos and now I have the photo. Okay. Wow. This is really cool. This is really well done. I like this. Uh, hello? <laughs> the fuck is going on? <clears throat> An investigation has begun into the tragic death of a six month old baby boy. Look, my baby boy just died. I've had a strange feeling. <laughs> what kind of god would kill an innocent baby? What kind of god would kill an innocent baby? This is all just super confusing. And awesome <laughs> in a very unique way. New objective, find clothing worn in the eyes of God. Does that mean like the wedding dress? Hello? Anyone here? Little Michael. I'm still not used to the name, but he's starting to grow on me. He's perfect. And he looks just like you. He's got your eyes. Oh my. You just keep dying. Over and over and <laughs> what over. What the fuck? I'm going to let you in on a little secret. You'll be stunned by a sudden burst of light. But only if they don't see it coming. What is this fourth wall breaking? Pull the switch. Bright light. She can't stand it. What the frick is happening? <laughs> Dev intervention, bro. <laughs> Excuse me, can I just flash her or something? Is that what I'm supposed to do? I thought I was doing okay, but I guess I suck. Sure, game. I was having a good time. No need to blast me. <laughs> this just became DVD. She's a phantom. Hello?
for the last holiday period reached a whopping 95 deaths. 60% of those were alcohol related. Maxwell Hume from the Pleasant Falls PD stated that alcohol fueled violence and car wrecks have become a huge problem. How much needless death does there need to be before we curb our vices? If you suffer from addiction, seek help now. <laughs> Can I leave? Nope. The year is earlier, indeed. There's a in memory here. Whoa! 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 Yo! Wait, this is so cool. What the fuck? 24th March, 1985. He's like a changed man out here. At first I wasn't sure this place is creepy, but last night was simply amazing. Maybe this was a great idea. It just needs a woman's touch. <clears throat> Interesting. This is a very cool filter. Do we explore? Axe time? Uh, I think I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> okay, sir. One little tree. Shall we sleep? 23rd March, 1985. He really surprised me this weekend. He blindfolded me and whisked me off in the car. When he took the blindfold off, I saw this horrible little rundown cabin in the woods. He'd purchased this place from an estate sale of a deceased hunter or something. He wants to fix it up so we'll have our own little romantic getaway. Maggie's staying with the neighbors for the weekend, so I guess I'll make the most of it. The answer lies below. Shove it away. Get rid of it. Wait, what's over there? I see you blinking. Thank you, Miss Nikki, for the 200 bitties. Another photo. Take with you. Boop. Can I move this out of the way? No? Excuse me. Do I have to click a button? Push it. Push it. Ah! I want to go below. Am I doing it wrong? Am I supposed to know what the... Hey, mister. Could you tell me? Can I sit on the chair? Take a picture of it? Okay, if you're stuck, take a picture. It does hold up. I don't know why, but sure. <laughs> they weren't lying. If you're stuck, just take a picture. Twenty fifth March, nineteen eighty five. I don't ever want to come back. Last night there were all kinds of strange noises. I could hear whispering. I think maybe some of the vocals don't want us here. I heard something in the basement and had to investigate. Oh my god. It's the slaughterhouse down there with some really weird shit going on. 
I appreciate taxidermy as an art form, but this looked like more than that. Between the cabins and the history and the strange noises, it would be a cold day in hell before I set foot in here again. This is how those horror movies start. Oh, there's a pile of, there's a, there's a huge, okay. Oh, it's the Necronomicon. Whatever. Oh! Oh! This game is so well made. I'm so impressed by this game. I legitimately, like, there were some people, there was, I, I kind of, Loki avoided this game. I'm gonna take a quick break before we because there were some like reviews that were Hinting on some problems in this game that sounded like some things that I wouldn't enjoy I legit have no idea where these people came from have, They must have played a different game. I swear to God. How could you like this the stuff that they've said on Maybe 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 some stuff will come up later, but I can't even imagine Like this is awesome. This is incredible cool this house is huge by the way uh oh uh oh uh oh is there is there a lady the wedding dress! Let's go! I knew it! I knew it! It's bad luck to see the bride before the wedding. Get out of here, you. Wait a minute. Come here, you. Oh, that's cute. Now go. We're gonna be late to the altar. But also, you know how this ends, so yeah. <laughs> Find clothing, warm. <laughs> Nap a bit. Oh, could I do that? I don't think I. I was like locked in place. I couldn't even move my cam at all. <clears throat> that's a that's a cutscene right there. <laughs> Angie, thank you for the for the sub. Ninety-five deaths. Sixty percent of those were alcohol related. Slaughterhouse down there was some really weird shit going on. Just needs a woman's touch. A cold day. Feels like I'm freaking playing a movie. This is so cool. <laughs> I like it. Very immersive. Oh. Okay. Well, this is definitely an asylum. Staff only. Extra's not permitted. Laboratory. Maximum security. Are we gonna go to maximum security? Operating theater for Dr. Minder. That's cool that you're on there. Did I not? Is it gonna come? I clicked on it. Hello? Maybe not? Oh, what's that? What's that red stuff over there? Hello? Hello? Anyone here? 
Anyone at all? Um, thank you, I guess. Why are you not to fuck? Dearest Dr. Tennis, I have tried to get your face to, f to I've tried to get you face to face. However, my movements around the facility are somewhat restricted. This is actually the reason for writing. I understand the need for heightened security, but I am unable to complete my work. I'm sending the bodies down the chute to that obese gentleman you have down in the morgue, as per my instructions. But I am unable to file my paperwork with the front office as it's always locked. You keep the only key in your office, making my access very limited. Key in the office. I'd kindly ask that you supply a copy of the key for me. I eagerly await your response. So we need to find the key in Dr. Tannis' office, right? Yes. Got it. Got it. It's a freaking spooky syringe. Yeah, it seems unlocked, but it's not. Oh, behind this, maybe? Oh my goodness, seriously? You bitch! But I tried to do the same with the with the other one! Okay, so we <laughs> I tried to do the same with the other one, and that didn't work, but this one does. Okay, then. Wait, you gotta go in here, right? No? Come on. That is... If this is not it, then I'm... Huh? Wait. Let me in. EU vents. It's under. I can see. It said it under me. I do not want to walk over the glass, please. Yeah, let me just go away. Bye-bye. If I walk over that glass, that guy's going to hear me and he's going to destroy me. <laughs> I vented, lol. Yeah, go on. I get it. I feel nice. I'm, I'm glad that was a quick reset, though. I probably have to wait for that guy to move away. You can't get too close to him. I get it. I get it. I get it. Can I sprint? I can see your butt. trying to throw at me through the wall there, but no. Uh-oh. What if I turn this off? Wait, I just locked that. Get fucked, idiot. But now this is locked. I appreciate that, though. I appreciate when games lock you off from going in the wrong direction. When it doesn't add anything. That is good. Wait, I need to lock him in there. Oh, that's genius. Wait, can I still go here or no? Oh, and it locks me off as well. So I'm gonna do... Yeah. Good stuff. We're gonna crickety crack. Oh. 
Go, 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 go. Yes, 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 get fucked, idiot! Dumbass. Dumbass! Got him. Okay. <laughs> okay! Fair enough. Uh-oh, he's banging on it. Uh-oh. He's banging. He do be banging. Go, 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 go before he bangs hard enough. Now we have elevator. Elevator, elevator. Go, 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 go. Run, don't come here, Mr. Man. ay 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 <gasps> He opened it up. Am I good? Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, oh, hey there. Hi, hi. How you doing? Uh, there's so many big boys. Uh, that's con That's an interesting elevator. All that training paid off, it seems, as she came first in the annual trial. Do you know who you are? Or do you? Some believe this is their life flashing before their eyes. There's really a moment of clarity. This is PT you right you here. What the fuck? That every action you take will bring you closer to your judgment. Do you understand the extent of your actions? The tormentor can become the tormented. The giver of gifts can become the receiver. I only got six months. I'm lucky. This reality isn't real. It's only a reflection. Of you. We'll be back after these messages. Jeebus. That is cool. Like, right now, this is basically, I mean, I know that I shit on Visage literally all the time, but this is literally what Visage was supposed to be. Visage fucking sucks, this game is good. Mom, I'm so sorry for everything that's happened to you. I can't do this anymore. Do you know how many times I hid under my bed listening to Dad hurting you? Falling asleep under the bed to the sound of you crying? I hate you for not taking me away from here years ago. I'm running away with my boyfriend, and I won't be coming back. I'd be safer living on the streets than I am here, and that's no way for me to live. I'm old enough now to understand that none of this is normal. Maybe we'll see each other again someday, but I never want to see him again. Get help, Mom. I do love you. Love always, Maggie. Dang. Dang. The throat goat, thank you for the sub. Um, okay then. <coughs> hey there! I tried to flush you and it didn't do a fucking thing! <laughs> this stupid slapstick sound effect. Uh, am I bugged? And did I bug the video game? Okay, thank you, God. <laughs> thank you for... I thought I bugged everything. <laughs> thank little... Oh. That was, uh, gonna be interesting. Hey, yo! I did it, I guess. <laughs> what 
What do you mean? Do I have limited photos? Why didn't I get the clicky? I did it? What? What am I doing? <laughs> I'm so confused. Wait, oh, you're talking about something in the past. <laughs> Do I have to go around, or is this here? Oh, it's right here. Throw the switch. Bright light. She can't stand it. Thank you, developer. Fucking garbage. I was trying to flash her, but it didn't do it. Didn't do it. Oh. All according to plan, baby. I knew exactly what I was doing. I didn't just accidentally press the levers and it just worked out. Let's go up land. <laughs> nice. Okay. Well, that was easy. <laughs> oh, we're in the office. 12th of April, 1996. I hadn't spoken to him in what seemed like an eternity. So shocked when he asked me to come back to the cabin. I Ooh. assumed he wanted to fix a marriage. Maybe try to move past everything and start over. Last time we were at the cabin, it was so romantic until the freak show started. And I vowed never to go back, but if we help our marriage, I'll try anything to win this nightmare. Once we got there, he just started babbling about this being the place of conception and rummaging through that fucked up basement. I don't know if I should be indulging him or getting help. I want him to get help, but I'm scared of how he react. Wow. So, so they're still in that cabin that we were visited a little while ago. Subordinates! It's come out to my understanding that many of you are complaining about access to the front office. There will continue to be only one key, and that key will continue to stay with me. As you may or may not be aware, the house safe is located in the front office, and I refuse to allow simply anyone to access it. If you need to lodge your paperwork, send it all down to the morgue, and Mr. Crave will file it on your behalf. Take a photo, it'll last longer. Huh? Wait, hey, is it, do I need to take a photo of this maybe? I can't, because it's a fuck. Wait, where's the photo? What do you, what do you guys see? What do you see guys? First thing that comes to your mind. Uh oh, she's coming. Wait. What is that? Is that a photo? Can I pick that up? Uh oh. Hey, what am I supposed to do? It, take a photo, it'll last longer. What? Is the key not supposed to be here? Am I being a dummy here? <laughs> What the fuckity heckity bae? Come on. But I already did this. I'm so confused. This will blast her, but then not. Huh? I am confused. Call me confused. Have I been a dumbass? Am I playing the game wrong? 
Pretty sure I actually died before. What? I've I've already been here, but this is not. Twelfth of April, nineteen ninety-six. Yeah, I, didn't we already talk I about this? Him at what seemed like an eternity. Wait. So I was Wait. shocked when he asked me to come back to the cabin. Oh, okay. He wanted to fix a marriage. Oh, okay. There's a code there. Start over. Last wow. Summer, is it was there writing over here? Can I see this shit? I need light. There's a code here. Can I turn on the light? No? Doesn't work? Okay then. How do we see? How do we watch? Let me through the free There seem to be a code here, no? Let's let's back up and take a photo. And then look at it. Yeah, I can't do that. It's fucking. I'm not. Are you joking right now? <sighs> oh, wait. I still have a. Why did it turn off my flashlight? I thought it just takes away my flashlight. <laughs> Why do I still have a. <laughs> when did my flashlight get turned off? I thought it just stole it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Una. Uh oh. Okay. Whew. I can't read this. I am too dumb for this. Have we seen this? Take a photo. It'll. Maybe the photo. Maybe if you take the photo, it'll give you the correct code or something. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> nice. Really cool. I like the way that the puzzles are very simple, which is exactly what you need in a game like this. Okay, then what do we have? Triangle. Remember, guys. Triangle. Goblet. Weird trident. Triangle. Triangle, goblet, weird trident, triangle. Tri oh. Okay. Triangle. Goblet. Weird, tri weird trident, triangle. Got it. That was good. I like that. Hey, that's a head. I'm not used to the name, but it's starting to grow on me. Perfect. And he looks just like you. He's got your eyes. <laughs> this is like one of those. This is like. <laughs> Wait, like an amusement park kind of <laughs> thing. Interactive museum, yeah. Okay, hey there. That's a lot of beer. Is it gonna overflow or do they disappear? They do disappear! I'm onto you, game. All you do is drink. You're a monster. You can't live like this anymore. It's kinda cool, too. I'm not the one with problems. I just need to numb the pain. I just need to numb the pain. Uh, a 
the Gladys? Jesus. Is that a bear trap? I stepped on it. Hmm. Oh, Chet froze. What the frick? What's going on here? What's going on here? Wait, it didn't on the stream, though. But it did for me. Weird. Hello. Do I have everything? I oh, jikes. Is it working now? It doesn't seem to be working. Oh, there we go. It works for now. Uh, while well, we're back here. Both of these nuts. Thank you for the eight months. This game is very creepy and cool. I like it, it, it. Like this keeps you immersed and scared. I too many games tried to hop into like making games frustrating, and that's like such it's such a shame. Whenever that is why why Visage felt so hard for me because they made their puzzles purposefully vague and like strange. You had to complete them in a certain order. You had to backtrack all the time. The house is super confusing. And here they just scra st they strip everything away except the cool story and horror part. Like, that's what I want. Maybe I'm just a simple man. Okay. The fuck? Okay. Well, this is the reception. We need the key? No, we don't need the key. Well, that's convenient. Hey there. Oh. Oh. Can we f can we get the code by doing the thing? No. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I'm not gonna guess that. I need to figure out what it is. Well, that is convenient. <laughs> 10 left, 50 right, 5 left. Left, right, left, 10, 55. Oh, wait, reset. So, do I, I spin the wheel left, right? So this way. 10... Oh my god. So sensitive. 10. 50. And 5. Nice. What is that? Oh, hey, there we go. It's the thing we need. Oh! I hate knives. She hates me for not standing up to him. She cried. Right now I'm all alone. And I wish my little girl would come home. You know, I can't just leave him like this. I can't just leave him like this. I feel like I'm. I feel like I'm playing a movie too. This is freaking awesome. So immersive. Burn the items. Exorcism time. Yeah, this is like movie night. <laughs> huh. Alright, let's go. 
Let's burn the items in the car bedroom. Right? Wasn't it here? I swear it was here. No? Well, that's a lot of... <laughs> I don't know what's... Isn't that the basement? Do I not... I think I have to go there, don't I? No, it's over here. I'm guessing because of the blinking lights. A search grid has begun over the crash site, but no survivors have been. So here he stands at the gate. Does he understand the extent of his crimes against his eternal soul? He can't set things right. It's over. He can ensure eternity is fitting for those he affected. I'm looking out here myself. Well, it's time to end it. Move on to the best part. That concludes our broadcast today. <laughs> Candles always light the way. Do -do 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 -do. Sunday roast dinner. That's a watermelon. <laughs> Woo! Spin the watermelon. Can you still watch stupid cooking show? No, there's nothing. Okay. Is it down here? Isn't this the bedroom? Uh What? I'm back where I that's not where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> Let's follow the music. Should in here? No. Is it downstairs? The fireplace? Here! Oh. Well, that's... It's just a fucking... <laughs> a child's play toy over like a cauldron full of blood. <laughs> that's something you don't often see. That is too close, Mr. Bear. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, hey there. Was there always a tree in the... I don't think there was. Give me that. That's a candle. Uh, there's another candle. Did I bug it? I did bug it. <laughs> I bought. I burned the items. No. Wait. What? 
Return to the scene of the crime. Was that up here? That was up here, right? Yes. Oh, uh, what the fuck? Oh, that's glass. No! Oh, no! Oh, my apples! Oh, fuck you! Oh, I hate you! Oh, no! What the fuck? Oh! I hate you! Did I die? What? Um... Wait, did I... Do I, do I have to read this again? Did it... How did... What? No... Oh, it's... Big Jim's Appliances! Big Sale! Huge chill. Oh, hey there. Um, yeah, nice. So this we're back. We did die. So I did die. Or didn't I? What? Huh? <laughs> uh... Well, I guess I'm just gonna go here... ...and burn the items again? No, I need the candle. Why are you... Oh, okay. <laughs> I bugged it again. Okay, um, so now I am not possessed this time, which means that I can probably just go up this and not get murdered. Exercise her from yourself. This is the scene of the crime, no? It was over here. Yes? He spread ashes. Spread ashes. Leave this place. It's very cool. Uh, okay. Well, bye bye. Can't leave the place. Do I leave with the car then, I guess? No? Well, I've already, this is not gonna help me. Can I? No, no reflection. Uh, that's the TV. That's the bedroom. Can I go through this door? Because this is how we entered the first time. Yes, I remember this. It's been a long while, but I remember it. It's only been, it's only been not even two hours. It feels like I've been like this is the theater feeling when you go to like the movie theaters and you step out of the theaters and you just feel like like you spend 10 hours in the in the in the cinema even though it was only like two hours fucking crazy oh uh oh starting to grow on me perfect and it's just like oh 
that's cool. That's a screenshot. Hello, Gladys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Whoa. Did that was so good holy shit that's one of the best indie horror game experiences ever that was like a fucking movie that was so that was one of the most immersive like well acted disturbing like I mean obviously it was very linear but it didn't really feel that way it just felt like all the game design properly led me to figure out things extremely quickly and just keep me going you want to keep your players going you don't want them to get stuck get frustrated do stupid puzzles time-based puzzles other garbage do like have them roll through the story like this be the have the story be good and you have like a wonderful this was a huge team as well what the heck like huge for a standards for some of the games that i play that was really good that was incredible i am i like this legitimately gave me that movie theater feeling where i just i've just i feel like i went through a freaking journey here and it was not even two hours long that's crazy awesome <laughs> That was a really good game. So much better than I expected. That game surprised me like crazy. I was not expecting this game to be this good. I am very, very pleased that I played that. Much shorter than I, uh, than I read. I thought it was three hours. I played it in two. <laughs> God gamer. <laughs> Wait, unless there is, unless there's more. It's not over yet. We got the credits, but it's not over. <laughs> oh, days served. Uh-oh. Oh, these these flies are, are tanking my frame rate. <laughs> uh, can the flies stop? Because they're ruining my FPS. Thank you, flies. Um the Exit Let's get out of here, shall we? What's happening? Inspirante? What the fuck? <laughs> What am I doing? Uh oh. <laughs> what? 
Uh, hey, oh, oh, oh. That's, uh, that. Can you put some clothes on, please? What the? What is happening? Wait, was that like. Was that like hell and you got to choose your. You got to choose your death. And then you can maybe go back and do them again? <laughs> you can do all the deaths. That was uh, interesting. Wow. Again, super impressive game. Very, very enjoyable. I uh, am blown away by the quality of this game. I did not expect it. I know why you guys suggested it now. Thank you very much for suggesting. Keep the great suggestions coming. I note literally almost anything down. I have a huge list of like two more than 200 games. So there's a lot on there. But uh, I love... <laughs> I, 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 will, I collect them and then I the things that are the most promising I will look at and we end up playing them quite often I've been really enjoying trying different indie games and different games in general uh, I still have not quite figured out how we can do series I, I still would love to do the forest at some point but it's such a long game and also kind of a more open-ish gamey so I don't really know how to do stuff like that, like Subnautica or The Forest or something. You might have to figure out a new format for that. Because these games, you can just play through them once, experience everything together, and then it's over. But with a game that doesn't... that's like open-ended, it's harder. But yeah, congratulations on surviving Infliction. You have unlocked chapters like bonus content and new game plus. All of these are now available on the title screen. Yeah, well that's very nice, but... Uh, we are going to call it there. This was a lovely experience. I need to lay down after that. That was beautiful. And I thank you very much for joining me on this journey. If you are not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash instant every single day at 7 p.m. Central European time. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for being absolutely amazing. I love you guys so much. Thank you very much. I'll see you around uh, wherever you are. In the, dis in the Discord, in the YouTube comments, on Twitch, anywhere. Love you all. Thank you very much. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>